Crazy Mike, crazymikesapps.com with an iPad app demo for Barnyard Bluegrass by Winoceros. This application is in the games category, works on the iPad and iPad 2, and sells for only $1.99. This is an interactive music education app that will have your child engaged in hours of singing, instrument picking, and playing while they learn about bluegrass classic music as well as kid bluegrass songs. Here is the opening tab, which is the singing tab. You can easily figure out how to do any tab by simply locating the question mark, in this case, next to the stop sign and tapping on it. Howdy! Looks like you found your way to the barnyard. Here you can poke around to play full bluegrass songs, some of which you probably already know. If you like these songs, you can download them off of iTunes or give them as gifts to your friends. So as you can see, we have a load of characters in the barnyard. You can tap on certain characters and you'll get a song. Some you may not get a song. It's up to you to figure that out. We'll tap on the choo-choo train over here and see what we get. Blue Railroad Train. You're going to get lyrics as well to sing along to, as well as the whole barnyard's a hooting and a hollering now while they listen to some bluegrass and play it. Now to stop any song, you simply tap on the stop sign. It will end the song, and you can pick a new song or you can go to a new tab. Now, one of my favorites is tapping on the hammer here. That cow can really play the bass, you know what I mean? This knife out hammer is a little too heavy. Dog for my size, dog for my size. Now there are also some kid songs that you can find, such as tapping on the spider web here. The chicken plays a mean mandolin if you ask me. We'll stop that and we'll go over to playing, which is the next tab. Here you can select a different bluegrass musical instrument and learn scales or listen to the scales. The major scales are over here on the bales of hay and the minor scales can be uh, accessed through the ladder rung. So I'll pick the banjo, which is my pig friend here, and then I can tap on the scales here on the hay. And explore. There's also other things you can explore, such as the birds and the spider, or maybe other things. You just have to poke around. See if you tap the right thing, you're going to get a little bit of extra. So you'll have to find that and figure out what you can interact with and what you can't on each page. Again, tapping on the ladder rungs plays the minor scales. And you can switch that up to a fiddle. go. Again, you can do that with all the different instruments, and if you want to figure out how to use this page, you can tap on the question mark in the upper right as all the pages. Go into the picking part. This is a cool page. Each of the animals is going to play a lick at the same tempo. You can touch some different things on here, and eventually you can get them all to play together, but if you tap on the pig, he'll play a lick, and they won't play them all at the same time originally. You'll have to you have to figure that out yourself and how you get them to play together. But you can tap on some of these flowers and you can figure that out. And if you do it right, you may have them all playing. Just got to figure out what to tap on. This guy over here, apparently the farmer, that who, that's who he is, he wants to get a little shut eyes, so he's not digging all the music late at night. This is a fun page, a lot of interaction. Lastly, you can go to exploring where you can go through each instrument and get a sample of by pressing the note below. So we can select an instrument. We'll pick the mandolin here. It gives you some information about the mandolin and you can have it read to you by tapping mandolin read to me. Comes in many shapes. The mandolin comes in many shapes, though it usually has a hollow body and is either round or teardrop shaped. It is much smaller than a guitar, usually a bit bigger than a violin. Mandolins have four pairs of strings for a total of eight strings. These double strings, along with the high pitch of the mandolin, give it a very distinct sound. Touch below to hear some mandolin. Again, you can touch some other items on here to interact and find out what you'll hear. You can also 
tap on the question mark to get instructions verbally read to you on how to use this page. Lots of other instruments to explore. The general store is our last stop. You can check out Flight of the Pamplemos, which is Winoceros' other book application, or you can go and tap on Barnyard Bluegrass and download those songs that you'll hear in this application from iTunes or gift them to others. That is Barnyard Bluegrass. Until next time, this has been Crazy Mike singing, see ya.